Hi, Cancer. Welcome to my channel. <laughs> We're doing your dailies. I'm back. <laughs> the 12 June dailies. Let's see how far we can go with this. <laughs> how are you guys? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Look for your Jupiter. That's your husband. The wife is the Venus. Ready? Here we go. Let's see what's going on. Let's see here. Cancer. Here we go. Let's see here. Let's see what you guys been up to. Mm -hmm. Let's see here. Got it, a magician. You've been up to something, that's for sure. As above, so below. Someone's creating something out of nothing because you understand the ethers. This is when you know, you know, like this is the energy when you pray and it's, you know, it's like, oh, hi, I know I'm gonna get this. I know I'm gonna get this. This is how you vibrate here. Regardless of what you do, your intention is so strong that you can manifest what you have basically been thinking of, okay? So this is it. That's why it's manifest, like it's a manifestor card. It's an action card also, okay? Could be dealing with a Virgo or a Gemini. You can use any of the tools here. That's why they also have your, you have all the tools. So you're probably very much well equipped right now. You bought something. You know, this is someone who's probably just, you know, got a whole haul, basically. That's what they call it. Something here is fixing a black eye, you know. This is the magician because I feel like, well, this because he's the nine of ones here. Either a black eye or something like you're putting on something on your blemish here on your face. That's what I feel here. It's like something's blemish and you just, you just a touch up here. Okay, that's for some, very, very few. Okay. Uh, with the nine of ones here, someone is uh, tired of making something happen also. Um, because a magician with the nine of ones, someone keeps trying to, tr trying to make it happen. They're the magician, yes. But, and they're not giving up, yes, but they're also tired about it, you know. They see that there's so much things that they still need to keep doing and doing. They need to keep doing this, Sal. They need to keep ask, de doing this, doing this, doing this. Never ending. If it's a movie, it's called a never ending story. Mm -hmm. Let's see here. Have the Ace of Cups, doing it out of love. That's for sure. The Ace of Cups, because... You know what is worth fighting for? It's always gonna say love. Well, it is here. This is something that's worth fighting for, not worth waiting for. Big difference. So this can be the connection that you have with this person, can be younger water sign. Now, here, how's the Ace of Cups or Aces work? Do you feel the love? If you feel the love, then this is you, okay? If you don't feel it, then this is the other person. Mm. So that's them fighting for it, or you fighting for it here. Extending here, can be meeting a new water sign. There's an even exchange though. Nine of Cups over here. Crisscrossing energy here. You love them, they love you. They see you as a soulmate, or you see them as a soulmate. Someone's gonna be offered over here. But this offer comes with a lot of things that has happened already in the past. Someone here was singled and butchered, you know, like they were the one really chasing for the connection, making it happen. And now it's only just now that it's manifesting. Very oh, wow. Yep, somebody is tired here. Ten of Swords here. Might as well feed me to the crocodiles, you know. Because the Ten of Swords is just like it's so painful. It hurts so much. You know, this is the acupuncture card for me. It's like you think it was healing, but it wasn't. You think it was addressing the issues, but it wasn't. It was all lies, lies, lies. Okay? Don't get lost. Magician. Okay? You're trying to really push something hard. Like you really want to go hard. Basically for you with the Magician and Nine of Wands here, either go hard or go home. Okay? And you're not going home because the Ace of Cups is here. It's worth fighting for. This is what you have chosen. Nine of Cups, it comes with you. And Ten of Swords is all about, you know what? Let's start all over again. Because Ten of Swords is the finality of the mind games, finality of the overthinking. It's all about the finals of the thoughts. It can be even someone who just finished their exams because this is a lot of tests. So you can be a student, you finish all the exams, and then now starts a new life. All right, so consider and I'm going to continue this reading as we move forward with these energies together with the four points. Link is down there in the description box, you know, if you want to follow the extended. Also follow me on IG, guys. I also post there one card read, have a one. Oh, and make sure to turn on the bell right there, I think. All right. Thank you very much guys for watching Concerns. I'll see you guys again. Ciao.